Hey, it's time to do some wrenching. Okay, what I have here is a Denzel oil filter. Got this at Rock Auto for two dollars and eighty-seven cents. It's made in China. It says so on the box, anyways. Feels nice and strong, heavy duty. It's got the plastic wrapping on on it, so that's that's nice to have on there. It's supposed to have a silicone anti-drain back valve, and has a regular bypass valve. And it's supposed to have dual layer filtration media. I couldn't find any numbers on the filtration, but um, let's cut this baby open and see what she looks like inside. Okay, here you go. She's all cut open. Got a nice base plate. You got eight holes. They look small from the outside, but then when you turn it over. They look elongated here, so you get a nice oil flow. Get your oil ring. It comes off fairly easy, so you have to be careful putting this on. It might come off. Twist around. Okay, and then you got your anti-drain back valve bypass valve. It's got a dual purpose. It's black, but I'm pretty sure it's a silicone. It feels like a silicone valve, so I'd say this is silicone. Your filter media itself, it looks good. Metal seam, metal end caps, and a metal core with louvers. And let me measure the width on this. We got it's about two and a half. I'll count the pleats and I'll cut this open and we'll see how long she is. So I'll be right back. Okay, forgot to mention about the coil spring also. It's got a nice coil spring. Nice and stiff. Okay, let's go and cut the meaty open. Okay, here she is. Long filter. I got 83 inches out of it. Stretch it out. There. Yeah. About 83. And I don't know what they're talking about, dual filtration. But it just seems like regular paper to me. I tried splitting it apart to see if it was a two-ply, but no, it wouldn't go. It just ripped and here's your inner. It's a little wider than most of them right here. But that's what she looks like. If you like the video, like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Thanks for watching and take care.